believe that fish need to be there for generations. They come back every year, they provide jobs, they provide a way of life that people in rural Alaska can live off of. Some of the important things that our kids learn from us when they're learning about subsistence are patience and teamwork and sharing. Taking our salmon away would be like uh, what happened to the lower 48 Indians when they took the buffalo away. We want even President Obama to say, yeah, Crystal Bay is a treasure and it's worth protecting. And that means no large scale development like mining in Bristol Bay. Everyone knows that it will destroy our land and there won't be anything because without fish, we don't have anything to Some of the facts started coming in about, you know, sulfite mines, they've always contaminated the water. For many of the people, the impact will be immense, basically because uh, uh, for over a thousand years, we've survived off the land, the water, and the air. Now you put a mine, the seismic activity, and the water, and that is no place for a mine. the mining industry tell you, oh no, fish and mining can coexist. We don't have to choose between fishing and mining. In Alaska, we can have both. And all of the studies that we've seen and all of the presentations that we've heard, fishing and mining do not coexist. One is one loses and it'll be fish that'll lose. And it, if it's fish that loses, then it's people in rural Alaska that lose. I've seen the worst mines in America. I've studied those and I have a feeling that's just, that's going to happen here and I don't want that. This is the salmon capital of the world, right here, Bristol Bay, Alaska. For us to be doing anything else but working in ways to stop pebble mine is like arranging deck chairs on the Titanic. So this pebble mine right now, as proposed, is supposed to be one of the world's uh, largest mines. The people in the region aren't going to change their opinion. But many of the people don't want to get bought out. They don't want their money. There's 82% uh, in our poll that are opposed to the mine. The mining companies know what they want. And uh, what they want, we can't keep. We can't keep gold. 